Junior with SOT Metalworks coming at you with another video. So what do we got going on today? Well, today we have a special sign for Watch Wes Work. So we met Wes and his wife uh, at the uh, Utility Expo. Got to hang out with them with uh, Dirt Perfect, the after meet and greet uh, situation we had going on. Uh, he contracted us, or they contracted us, to do a sign for them. That's what we're gonna do. We're going to put the good old CNC, Shop Saver CNC plasma table to good use. Get us a sign cut out for Watch West Work and see how this one happens. There's not a Ford emblem in it. I'm sure he's disappointed, but it is his logo. And we'll see how good a job we do getting it cut out. So let's get after it and see what happens. We guess nothing. All right, let's get into it. All right, ladies and gents, as you can see, we are on the Shop Saver Plasma Control here. Uh, this is the, the controls we use to run the CNC plasma table. This is not our editing software. This is just for the plasma to write all the G code and what have you. What we got going on, we're sitting on a uh, four foot by four foot piece of uh, 14 gauge, fixing to get this joker cut out and see what happens. So sparks are fixing to fly and hopefully we don't mess nothing up. Uh, we kind of been notorious for uh, some uh, tip problems here lately, but that's okay. All that's solved. All that is squared away. Got new consumables in the torch head. Everything's good. Let's keep our fingers crossed and hope that this one turns out uh, just like it's supposed to. Because I'm, I'm going to tell you what, guys. Metal prices have went... I mean, they surpassed the roof. They have went to the moon. I mean, they are crazy right now, but... And the quality uh, you're seeing here on this stuff is not as good as it should be. Beggars can't be choosers nowadays, but we'll get it cleaned up and make it look all prim and proper and things will be just, just right. So, all right, let's get after it, get some sparks flying and see what happens. here's what we got going on we got the watch west work sign all squared away so we went with 24 by 24 inches but his sign did a little different so it's actually 23 inches wide uh, and 26 inches tall I squared everything up made the circle uh, completely round the whole nine yards sometimes cutting these signs out you got to play with sizes to make everything work just so so but yeah, so he wanted a 24 by 24, but he got a 26 uh, by 23. So, hey, it, it is what it is. It is what it is. So this one's going to turn out pretty good. We're going to go get it over here on the wire wheel, uh, get it all cleaned up, get all this stuff squared away, get it prepped and ready for paint, and see what happens. But I got to do a shout-out to Wes because I'm going to be honest with you. This is a fairly simple, straightforward, easy-to-do logo wes i greatly appreciate that buddy if you watch this that that is awesome nice to do a simple easy <laughs> logo some of these logos i get are a, a a just a chore to do sometimes but now don't get me wrong uh some some logos are a chore to do and they're cool they turn out fantastic it is what's made our business our business 
uh, just these intricate logos and signs and stuff like that. But every once in a while, guys, it is nice to do a simple, plain Jane, not, it's not really plain Jane, but straightforward, straightforward logo. It is nice to do sometimes. Because sometimes I sit here more times than not scratching my head wondering how I'm going to get this logo done and how many pieces it's going to turn out to be. Wes, I greatly appreciate it. This is, this is a very easy one to do. Not taking away from your logo in any way, shape, or form. I think it's awesome. And just so you know, got another little tip. I'm going to send Wes these W's. We're not going to paint them up. We're not going to do anything with them. We're going to send him the W's along with his uh, logo sign and let him do with with uh, these what he wants to do. Uh, just uh, I'll clean them up a little bit. You can see they've got the, uh, the, the lead in, lead out there on the W, but hey, he may want to put those somewhere and do something with them. Who knows? You, you never know. I'm trying to think, you know, think ahead there. Think ahead. All right, let's get back after it, get these cleaned up, see what happens. And then we'll get some primer on here, and next thing you guys will know, we'll be putting paint on here, I'm sure. So, all right, let's get after it, get back to work. Enough goofing off. All right, let's get a little paint on it and see what happens. Going with a good old white. Looking mighty spectacular. This is going to turn out a pretty cool sign. Always love this white and black uh, on these logos. Always seems to pop real good. Come out really, really well. The sun is shining here in Kentucky today. It has warmed up a little bit today. I waited until this afternoon to get a little color on here on these signs. Let them get warmed up a little bit. It uh, has been rather chilly. Rather, rather uh, chilly here the last couple days. Make sure you get all them sides. You guys know how I say that all the time. Got to get those sides. You'll miss one little edge and it will ruin a sign, guaranteed. All right, let's get that over on the drying rack. We'll get the other piece on here and see if we can get some paint on it. All right, guys, here we go. We are back on the Watch West work sign. You can see I've already got a little fingerprints on that joker right there, but that's okay. We'll get her cleaned up. So we've got the uh, front piece that goes on the backer, and this will be Watch West's Watch West Works logo. i uh, say that three times fast, and we're about to get it squared away. So you can see I've got some uh, reference tape here where everything goes. Side will line up over there, side will line up there, side will line up there, and this W point right here, Goes to the very tip top, uh, and, and kind of lines up with that top up there on the uh, on the backer. So this should be fairly straightforward, but you never know. So let's get it put on and see just what happens. All right, ladies and gents. So we've got our uh, gorilla double-sided tape on the back side here. That stuff will take the skin off your fingers going to see if we can get this laid in here just right this sometimes is fairly tricky but sometimes you just gotta go for it you know what I mean we got that one down there that one up there is lined up that one right there is lined up That is not too shabby. That turned out fairly easy. Not too bad whatsoever. Fairly, fairly easy. Got just a little smudge. I gotta get some cleaner and clean up these fingerprints. <clears throat> fingerprints on this black just show up so tremendously. But, got a little dirt on the sign. Not too shabby, what you guys think? 
All right, got the camera a little more squared away, but yeah. Not too bad. Watch Wes work. If you guys haven't, make sure you go over and check Wes out. He always seems to be working on a Ford over there. I can't figure that out. I mean, not too many Chevrolets, but maybe Fords need worked on more. I, I, I don't know. I, I, I'm, not, I'm not saying anything bad about brands. Just saying he works on a lot of Fords. That's, you know, that's just part of life, I guess. I don't... Well, we got our mounting hose in here. We'll get our... Uh, we get our uh, felt pads on the back. That way when you hang it on the wall, nothing scratches or anything like that. So I think this one pretty much wraps this up. Not a, not an, like I said before, not an extremely hard logo. You just gotta make sure everything gets lined up prim and proper and everything is looking good. And I think it done pretty good. What do you guys think? Did I get the sign straight? That's the main thing. All right, ladies and gents, that is the Watch West Work sign uh, logo. If you guys are not subscribed to West, you guys need to head on over there and check his channel out. You may want to subscribe and hang out with that gentleman. He uh, he does a lot of cool stuff over there. We got to meet him at the Utility Construction Expo. Got to hang out with him uh, at Dirt Perfect's little uh, after party he had going on there. It was pretty cool. Pretty, pretty cool guy. Him and his, him and his woman there oh, were mighty fine to talk to you, I guarantee it. So, all right, guys, that's going to do it for us. If you need anything like this, make sure you look us up, sotmetalworks.com. Shoot us an email, shooters, option targets at gmail.com. We'll get you guys squared away with a fine, outstanding sign. Hey, and if you want to watch West Works uh, logo sign there, I mean, I'll sell it to you, but i got to pay him some royalties for that stuff. So. <laughs> All right, guys, we're going to cut on out of here. Hopefully, you guys are staying safe. And as always, remember, work smarter. Y'all stay safe out there. We out of here. Y'all have a good one.